WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of, well, overcast Delray Beach, Florida. Nonetheless, this is your 1 p.m. update. Currently a mixed bag out here. The Dow down 74 points while the S&P is up 10. NASDAQ 100 up 128. Russell's off 15. Semis are up 54. A true mixed bag out here. Gold down 770. Silver down 23 pennies. Lights we crude up 34 cents. Well, that's the December contract. Let me just change that real quickly here. That has rolled over to January of uh, 2022, F22, there we go. So Light Sweet Crude is up 58 pennies, trading out at 78.15. Uh, let's go spend a little time with our market update chart. We'll begin by taking a look at the ES Mini. Now there's a new profile, I'm gonna, let me hit the refresh button here. So there's been new profiles that the ES Mini has been attempting to form all day long. There's a new one up there. Many of you might have seen, if you were looking real quickly, you might have seen another profile that was up there. So this has changed. This one here has changed in the last 15 minutes. Nonetheless, this is the information that we'll use. This is a bearish structured profile, the prior profile. Now this will not, we will not have confirmation on this until this evening, 6.01 p.m. But right now we use the data that we have, resistance up at the 4709 level. If price gets below 4675, that's a decent signal that price should make its way to 4633, the bottom of that profile. Now that would more likely come to fruition if we see the spot follow tunics, which is tinkering with the 50 day exponential moving average, which is currently printing at 1756 and priced at 1708. A close above 1756 today, more likely than not, we'll see the ES Mini go target the bottom of that daily profile. And that's at the 4633 level. Right now, the NQ is trying to take out its all time high. That's a TD9 count top on November 5th. If there is a close today above 164850, it'll negate that signal. Otherwise, the signal remains in effect out here. If you take a look at the U.S. dollar index, uh, although it has not identified a or has not formed a topping pattern per se, there is an A to B equal CD to the upside. No bearish reversal candle just yet. Here, too, it's trying to form a new bearish structured profile, which would suggest if price can close below 95.54, the U.S. dollar index should move down to the 94.58 area. Gold inside a bear structured daily profile. Resistance at 1879, support 1813. Silver looks very bullish out here. <clears throat> it continues to test and reject the top of its daily profile. This suggests that what silver wants to do is move up to the 2656 level. Lights we crude holding support. That's at the 7723 area. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show. We'll be up in just a few minutes. Thanks so much for joining us. Take care. The reality 